Hey guys, so we decided to hook up what we call the train, the boat, the camper, the truck. Yep, I'm one of those guys going down the highway with that. It's really not too bad. But uh, we're in uh, Walsenburg, Colorado. We're going to spend a few days at Lathrop State Park. And we're going to do some boating, tubing, wakeboarding, that kind of stuff. Uh, of course, we might have some burgers and uh, beers and yada yada. Check out the new advertisement. So if you see us going down the highway, honk, wave, do something like that. See you in a little bit. I'm glad you're my backer upper because you're like the pro. I do request you, you know. Do you? I do. Okay. So here, so here's what happened. So we go to the boat show last January and uh, accidentally bought a wakeboard. And this is the first time I get to try it. So if you look behind me, you see the water, how smooth it is. Hopefully it works. If not, I wasted a lot of money. But it is pretty though. Watch this, come here. Nice and white, Ronex, new bindings, boa laces. Like you know what you're doing. Okay, so now we gotta throw the, uh, the beach anchor out. Actually, I use two anchors. One on the beach and one out in the water. I like to back my boat into the beach. Um, it just kind of keeps it a little cleaner. You know, people, instead of dragging like gravel and mud and all that, as they walk through the water, get on the boat, onto a ski deck. It's a perfect way to keep your boat clean. And uh, we should be listening to some music today. Hopefully it's what you like. Let's go throw the anchor. Okay, so funny story about this anchor. I have a small little ski boat and uh, I kept buying these anchors and we'll get some wind storms come through and my boat would drag because in Colorado we have like a lot of just like real kind of clay stuff and, and the anchors doesn't, they don't really hold very well. So I went to the boat store. So look, I need an anchor that's gonna hold. This is what I ended up with. This big boy right here. The guy, when he sold it to me, he says, well, that's for a cabin cruiser. That's a little too big. And let me tell you, it's the best anchor ever. By the way, this is Wilson 2.0. We lost the original one.
Hey, sir, you gonna go in the water? Huh? You gonna rescue daddy? Yeah? <laughs> So brand new board, brand new bindings, new stance, never been in the water. It's like, um, we'll see if I could even get up. Look how beautiful this water is. It doesn't get much better than this. How do those bindings feel? Um, they ratchet super nice with this boa. So I have boa laces on my mountain bike shoes and all the dirt gets in there and not really, I mean they work but I wasn't too impressed. But in the water I think it's gonna be a much better deal. Yeah. And supposedly they don't get loose. What are we doing with the Switch 180? We're, I have to lean back. Lean back. The pool. Because who told you? That is the dude on YouTube. It's Sean Murray. Okay, there Sean Murray, the dude on YouTube. Yeah, because he's cool. No. So, lake life sucks. Right. <laughs> horrible. And look at the Rocky Mountains in the background. But you know what? You are with us, and that's the best part about this. Donna D, take the glasses off. Take your coat off. I want my coat on, it's cold. <laughs> Get that board, the pretty one. You can do this. Doesn't my board usually go on the top? No. Oh, yeah, it does. Okay, so here's the plan. This water is cold. And we're going to get Donna on the ski deck and point it in the right direction. And when she says, I'm ready, she's going to jump in the water. I'm going to fire it up. I'm going to try to get her out of the water as soon as possible. And the funny part is, if we can get the camera going, as soon as she hits the water, she'll be like going, OK, 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 go, go. <laughs> if you go back to our video from uh, Puerto Rico, El Junque, where we jumped in the water, that's what she did. Am I wrong? No. <laughs> hey, sir. What do you think? What do you think? You gonna go swimming? Where the geese? See geese? Where the geese? No, I don't jump in the water. I was kidding. I was just kidding. <laughs> So, what'd you say, Donna? I can't hear you. She used bad language. I did. You said something about nuts? This is nuts, yes, that's what I said. See, it is on the inside. Donna has the pretty board. She has the fancy boots with the gold little buckles and they're like gold lipstick on it or right there. Why do you gotta be all fancy? I'm just trying to keep up with Bougie Mike. There's no keeping up with Bougie Mike. Okay. OK, 
Okay, unfortunately, we're gonna have to cut this video short. Uh, the lab that you saw in our boat earlier, well, um, he was doing fine, but then all of a sudden we had some, he was acting funny, long story short. We had to take him to the uh, emergency vet and uh, his intestines got all wrapped up around his stomach. And thankfully, it uh, wasn't a, a good, uh, I guess typically it's a bad thing, but uh, he survived. He's good. So a happy ending to the story. And uh, but we're gonna cut this video short. And uh, thank you all for watching. And uh, pray for us. And you know, uh, I gotta say, uh, man, what the vet said about him surviving. Uh, there's definitely a father looking over us. So thank you, everybody. Love you. Take care.